Hello, I'm Don Ransberg, and this segment is called Inside the System Unit. The basic unit of information in a computer is the bit, a single circuit whose electrical state is represented by the binary digits 0 or 1. A sequence of 8 bits, called a byte, is sufficient to represent the basic letters, numbers, and punctuation marks of most languages. Bits are used to describe data transfer rates, whereas bytes describe storage capacity. Common transfer rates are kilobits per second, or kbps, megabits per second, or mbps, and gigabits per second, or gbps. These respectively correspond roughly to 1,000, 1 million, and 1 billion bits per second. Common storage units are kilobyte, KB, megabyte, MB, gigabyte, GB, and terabyte, TB. The respective sizes of these units are 1,000, 1 million, 1 billion, and 1 trillion characters. The system unit contains the motherboard, memory, circuits, power supply, cooling fans, internal speakers, drive bays for storage devices, and expansion cards. The computer's motherboard contains the microprocessor, the system clock, the chipset, memory modules, and expansion slots. The computer central processing unit, CPU, processes data in a four-step machine cycle using two components, the control unit and the arithmetic logic unit, or ALU. The control unit follows a program's instruction and manages four basic operations, fetch, decode, execute, and store. The ALU performs arithmetic and logical operations. The performance of the microprocessor is determined by number of transistors, their proximity to each other, processing speed, the data bus width and word size, clock speed, operations performed per microprocessing cycle, the use of parallel processing, and the type of chip. The computer's main memory, random access memory, or RAM, holds programs, data, and instructions currently in use for quick access by the processor. Level 1, Level 2, and Level 3 cache, physically positioned within or close to the CPU, operate at speeds faster than RAM and keep frequently accessed data available to the processor. Read-only memory, or ROM, holds pre-recorded startup operating instructions. A variety of ports and connections enable peripheral devices, such as USB drives, external hard drives, digital cameras, and iPods to function effectively.